is our attempt at a hit single that went horribly wrong. <laughs> when we were trying to ride on the zeitgeist of silver chair. This was a song that we actually thought the kids of Australia would sit around the campfire and strum on their acoustic guitars. But we were wrong. But we, it was a song that had a sentiment that kind of holds good in even the best of situations. This is a song, ladies and gentlemen, about finding yourself in a, a very big fucking hole and deciding to decorate it and hang around there for like two or three good years and get to know yourself more than anybody really should and anybody could. And you try to go back home to mum and dad, but that doesn't work because they don't want you. So you call your mate, Phil from Grinspoon. I love that guy. And you're like, Phil, I'm fucking hanging on by a thread, man. It's getting awfully dark in here. What do you suggest? And Phil goes, man, it's really easy. Just fucking go down to Bunnings, get yourself a power drill, a power saw, bit of wood, and build yourself a coffin. <laughs> and you kind of go like, fuck, thanks, Phil, but like, I think I might watch Good Morning Australia. So you're sitting there watching Good Morning Australia, and you realize your life's fucking awesome. <laughs> You got fuck all to worry about. <laughs> well, I don't know, it was just something that come to me like today. I'm like, where have all the flies gone? That was the other thing that, what's fucking worrying me? Like, where have all the flies gone? I ate fish and chips today and one fly. <laughs> New South Wales, what is fucking up with your flies? That's the stuff that keeps me awake at night. That's another album, and that was... That's not this period. <laughs> this is a song, ladies and gentlemen, dedicated to my good friend, Phil. And anyone out there who's having trouble getting a Tinder date with Gina Reinhardt. This is a song... This is a song called... It's actually realising this whole album is like a season of Fleabag. <laughs> and you get to episode five of season one and she turns and she just says these incredible words and you actually write to them and say, why didn't you use this in fucking episode five of Fleabag? This is called Everything Is Fucked. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you. 